Yo, what is up guys, your boy Sonic Bros here and we are going to be playing Sonic Ages. Now this game was showed off at um, Sage 2018 and Sage 2017 and uh, when I first saw it um, in Sage 2017, I'm pretty sure I didn't have a, a good gaming computer at the time, which is why I didn't play through it. But uh, since now I'm uploading fan games, I really want to check this one out just so you can see the um, animation quality on Sonic is just great. And this reminds me of a game that I'm uh, actually uh, fanging and I'm actually pretty excited for uh, that someone's creating. I will uh, leave um, more information about that in the description below. But basically, he's trying to create a fan game that's inspired by the way Sonic looks in the the Sonic Hedgehog movie, um, the one with Metal Sonic, the one that's kind of, the one that's technically a Japanese OVA, but they call it a movie when they, um, when they moved it over, when they localized it in, um, the West, but, uh, yeah, so, when I saw, when I saw the proof of concept for that, and I saw this fan game, it kind of got me excited to play this fan game, but, um, looking at this game, Obviously Sonic looks great, and um, the scenery around looks great, but it's kind of weird how some of, some things are still kind of pixelized. I know this game isn't finished, it's an early demo, which makes sense. Like, I like the way the spice looks, but the water, the top of the water just looks weird. And also before, Sonic didn't have a spin dash animation when he was in the, when we were in the tutorial section that he does here. I'm surprised that they were going for this kind of um, Sonic CD aesthetic and didn't give him a super peel out. Like, when he's running super fast, he uses the peel out animation, but it, to me it doesn't make sense why they wouldn't have the peel out in the game. Like, I don't know. Look, when um, when you're when you're running at top speed, it does have the peel out animation. But to me, it just doesn't make sense why the peel out isn't here if that's what they're going for. I mean, I don't know if this is the speed true music from Sonic CD, but this sounds like something that would be in Sonic CD. So why wouldn't they? If that's the art, my point is, if that's the art style that they're going for, why didn't they put the peel out? In? I do love the way Sonic looks in this uh, game though, it's, it's amazing. So here. Damn, I actually got hit. I do like the way the rings look too. The one problem I have, like I know I'm, I'm speaking very negatively about this fan game, but I do think that they're, this, for what I've seen so far, looks great. You can tell that they're putting a lot of effort to this one. And I really do, uh, I really do appreciate fan games that do, um, that put this much effort in, but uh, everyone's a critic, so I'm gonna be a little bit, I'm gonna be a little bit critical of my opinions, even though I do think this is uh, pretty great so far. One thing that's really, really weird is that Sonic doesn't have a walking animation. So like he starts off jogging slow, like when he's going fast it looks fine, but when he's just walking it looks kind of weird. And there's the peel out, the peel out animation. And the peel out animation looks really really cool, which is the main reason why I'm upset that peel out isn't a main thing, because uh, the peel out animation looks great in this game. Doing surprisingly well for a Sonic game. Never mind. I jinxed it. But um, one of the I love I love the art style that they're going for with Sonic, but it doesn't translate well into this beginning. Oh my god, into this beginning stage because it like 
look at Sonic, he's vibrant, he's colorful, like he's full of life with his animations, obviously. But then you look at the stage that we're playing and it's kind of drab, boring, and generic. I'm not saying that this area looks bad, but for the way Sonic looks, how colorful, oh my god. How colorful he is, it just doesn't fit. Like this background, the water background looks really, really cool and it fits because Sonic's colorful. Is this, am I gonna die? Yeah, I'm gonna die. Sonic's colorful, the background's colorful, but this is just boring and this, I don't know, that blue color just looks, this doesn't look that good. This game really does have some great ideas, some, some great ideas, and uh, I know it's um, early in development, so um, so far every. I don't know what that was, but so far this game does look great. I'm so bad with the insta shield. We're not doing this. All right, here we go. Yeah, this game, for a fan game, it looks great. This kind of reminds me of Shantae Half Genie Hero, which is a game I need to finish, actually. Because I do love the, um... I just love the making a 2D platformer with animations like this. And for some reason, these now bounce. Okay. Alright! Can I actually beat this stage? I'm all the way back here? I do love the spin dash animation. Alright, Sonic, stop. Come on, game! Sorry, I'm trying to focus so I don't die again. Whoa! That's that's actually pretty cool. I was still spice was avoidable, but okay. I will say one thing about this fan game that's actually really good is that the um Ooh the fire shield does it actually work? Okay, hold on. It does! Okay. I can't Am I dead? No, I'm not dead. I can't wait for them to give the fire shield an animation. Cause uh That's gonna look really really cool. Go up there, Sonic. Okay. Right, here we go. I do think. All right, I think I was. <laughs> I did sound really, really critical at the beginning, but uh, I do think this looks great because they do have a mix match of uh, some pixel graphics, probably because of time constraints, because of Sage. Um, but yeah, this looks great. Like, I think the game does look great. Um, some of the pixel things do, does kind of throw it off, but obviously that stuff hasn't been animated yet. So it's kind of just like, you know, you kind of kind of wait for them to... Is that it? Is that just the one stage? Why is it still playing the background music? Game? Game? Why can't I start? Uh, alright then, it's not letting me click anything, so I guess that's it. So that was, um, Sonic Ages, I just, I don't know what's going on, I don't know why it's still playing that same music and not letting me click anything, but it just, uh, I don't know what happened. But with that said, this game is, uh, I love the way the, the aesthetic they're going for, I just kind of wish that with the beginning stage they were, it kind of, it's continued that aesthetic, colorful Sonic. The way the the way the game started off, I was that's that's what you kind of expect it to be like colorful and and vibrant with the with the drawing kind of look, and then you go into it and it's that 
drabby kind of stage. That's one complaint I do have with it. But for the most part, it controls well, it looks nice, and I'm really looking forward to where this game's going to go in the future. With that said, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace!